if you think about Starbucks, you could think of them as the largest and most successful co-working operator to date. If you look at the adjectives that describe millennials and you look at the adjectives that describe co-working spaces, there's almost an, a complete sinking of the two. The future workforce desires more and more mobility, flexibility and choice. And uh, co-working spaces, they offer very flexible leases. They offer you the chance to move around. You're not fixed to just one desk. Those are ways in which would resonate with the future workforce. You are connected to people who are sitting around you in a co-work space that you can actually collaborate with them on your ideas. Just by the people who walk in there bringing in such big ideas, you start dreaming big. In the US, you know, it's estimated by 2020, almost 50% of the workforce will be freelancers. They're not going to work alone. You're actually more effective working as a team. So co-working spaces can offer that. It helps to curate a community of like-minded people to attract them to come together. There's also been a huge interest in corporate involvement and how that can energize their staff and bring them closer to what's happening on the ground. You want to be plugged into the future, you have to be plugged into a co-working space.